Now that we opened a 9 volt alkaline battery, we have to open a LiPo battery. It was a really good battery because I flew with it a lot with my quadcopter. And I and it broke during a crash. Yeah, one cell was broken. Oh, there is there is some white crap in in here. So this is the protective shell, and then you have a protective tape here, like really strong plastic. like double-sided paper tape and I already smell the polymer the yeah it's really strong smell of chemical it's, it's pure chemical that you will smell mmm this is really bad I kind of don't want to smell that ah so I have a leakage, that's for sure. Here you have some uh, protection for all the wires. And here there is like rubber. Ah, oh, this is really bad. Yeah, you need to wear gloves, but... It's gonna take a couple of minutes and then I'm gonna wash my hands, so it doesn't gonna penetrate my skin. I don't do this every day. It's actually the first time I really touch it like this. Ooh, this is dangerous. This is really dangerous. If now this and that touch and it's welding itself together, I need to run. This is actually really dangerous. I like sparks, <laughs> I like fire, but not in a way that I can't control this. So don't try this at home. Okay, here you see the balance leads for this cell, the balance leads. Oh, this is really dangerous, really dangerous. This and this can touch. So you have, this is a 4S battery, a 4 cell battery, and you can clearly see it has one cell, two cell, three and four cells. So you have the combined voltage of the four cells. And this is the black and the red wire right here. This is the combined voltage of all four cells. And then you go with the black to the positive of the first cell. And this is this green wire. This combined, you have the voltage of the first cell this very first cell. So that's about it about the LiPo.